Hey guys, welcome back to Twitchy Plays XCOM Enemy Unknown. We are, well, let's open up this event list. We are one day off of finally getting the Hyperwave Relay built. We have been doing this for, I don't know, I've lost track of how many episodes now. Something like four episodes. Even the firestorms we have been waiting on for like five episodes. Uh, well, so let's, let's, let's just go with this hype and get this time over and done with. So we can just go, bam, cutscene. Like, we're, we're all here for the cutscene, right? I know I'm here for the cutscenes. Yeah, well, it looks pretty good. It's sleek. It's nice. It's got LED lights all over it. I presume that's LED lights. And what's this thing on the back here? Some sort of ion drive that is just so beyond our comprehension that well, obviously our scientists built it. Yeah, I don't know. Kind of, kind of a bit contradictory there, but whatever. Uh, and I do notice that almost every type of propulsion comes out blue. Uh, obviously to do with high MGs or something. Is that leveling the playing field, is it? Just a little bit, just a little bit. So we can we can start making these things now, right? Yeah, yes, we can. All right. Uh, we're not going to carry on. We're going to assign a new We've project done some because big things here. But I have to admit, my team and I are most proud of the work we put into the firestorm. Yeah, but where do we do? What? What? Yeah, where do we do? Where do we do? There's the demon one. Is that? Is this it? Confirm zero kills. All right, let's edit the, lo the loadout. We can't give it anything else because everything else is already carrying all our stuff. Ah! So let's give it the Phoenix Cannon. Yeah? Or do we want to give it a new weapon? I think we want to give it a new weapon. Like, a brand new, um, fresh off the... No, not the facilities. Wow. Fr fresh off the, the, the production line. Big-ass weapon. Can we do that? Yeah, we can. Let, uh, is Phoenix the highest one? Uh, we don't... Where do we get the information about which one does which? Anyway, this is green. This is much higher than, like, the laser or the phoenix, okay? So that, that's the way I'm going with it because the, the things I've noticed is metal, laser, plasma. I, I'm hoping that's right. It's only going to cost us 73 creds, so let's do that. Yeah, I just want the one to go on my thingy thing. I like to put plasma all over my thingy thing. Uh, right, so what are we going to do now? Well, we're going to come back here and we're going to find out what happens when the hyperwave relay gets completed. Ah, like, just like that. It's a big spinny thing! Uh, is, uh, are we gonna get any more than it's a big spinny thing? It do doesn't look like it, no. Okay, so let's, uh, do we want to put a new construction in place? The thing about this new construction in place is, well, what are we gonna build? You know what I'm saying? You, you know what I'm saying, bruv. Uh, we could build like some laboratories, some workshops, satellite uplink, or power generator, but there's just no no point. Even the power we're doing all right on, and we've got one of everything we need. Uh, we should actually do be doing stuff that we don't, we generally don't do, uh, and that is, of course, improving stuff here. Like, what's this? Is this all? Is this all for the shivs? This is the problem that I, that I seem to be getting. Is there's, it seems to be all for the shivs, and that's not not what we're after. Um, Flexible Thin Man has given us uh, new ideas for improving our med kits. We now can increase by... Uh, yes? Maybe? The advanced repair is for the shiv. Shiv laser. Ammo conservation. Ooh. This might be good. I mean, it's expensive. It is expensive. An improved pistol or the drone capture. Uh, could be upgraded to capture enemy drones. Giving us control of the flying drones for the remainder of combat mission. Now that... That would be pretty cool, would it not? But it would actually take all my money. Uh, indeed, the monies that I'm looking at... It, it's its 150 across the board, really, or above, isn't it? I can't... Why can't this go up? Let's, let's use my mouse wheel. Um, the alien grenades. Let, let's do that. Well, we never really use it, do we? We never really use it. Um, okay, well, there we go. There's, there's my foundry stuff. Uh, there was something else we wanted to do. We wanted to come across... Is it the situation room? Our engineering team has managed to negate billions of dollars in traditional aerospace development with a single ship. Oh yeah, you know that's what we do. As the alien attacks have become more frequent, our casualty rate has climbed. No shit. Our troop shortage is becoming a problem. We should start screening potential candidates at the barracks immediately. Well, I was kind of hoping to grab some like you know trained guys, but what I'm doing now is we're going to the side lab. Soldiers for testing within the side lab. Once we have a complete report, I'll notify you with the results. Our current research implies a strong link between a candidate's willpower and their psionic potential. We're hoping that one or more of our existing soldiers will meet the necessary requirements. Well, I was going to do that, but then I had a look at how many soldiers I've got, and I'm like, whoa! It, like, with the amount of wounded we've got, we can't even actually field a full squad at the moment. So, um, 
Yeah, let, let's just let's go hire some soldiers. Do we hire soldiers here? Where do we where do we hire them? There we go. Uh, oh wow. Okay, let's let's just get ten. No, jeez, that's going to cost me most of my money. Let's just get five. <laughs> There we go. There's some money gone. Oh wow, <laughs> that was a that was a chunk. But should we uh, have a look at the soldiers? See who we've got now. Are they coming in? They're not coming in. How long did it take for them to come in? Are they are they kind of down here somewhere? New soldiers arrive at XCOM HQ in HQ. Yep, HQ in three days. Well, I suppose all we can do is just wait for that to happen. We've all, of of course got the alloy cannon ticking away as well. That that's brilliant. Oh wait. Someone wants five light plasma rifles, and we have only have three in thing, but they will give us a lot of money if we do that. Should we see how much a light plasma cannon works? How much is that going to cost me? Uh, let's go to engineering, build items, light plasma cannon, light plasma, sorry, rifle. There we go, three. Can we make two more? Because that money boost would be most ah oh, insufficient funds would you believe it should not have spent the money on those new soldiers in fact uh, yeah it would have only left me with two credits but i could have been done it oh well um well i suppose we're gonna have to just let that one slide unless we get unless we get some extra money from doing a mission which is what i'm going to be trying to do next we're just going to carry on scanning i really would like to yes all right cool we've done the alloy cannon research what else do we have does this mean that i didn't actually want to make the plasma cannon look at this look at this beast okay yeah that does kind of mean we didn't want to make that and the mp cannon that would be quite nice um, okay, so let's do some ghost armor because that is next on our list. Eight days, nine days. Yeah, let's do that. Now the ghost that we armor. Are in control of the hyperwave beacon. The real question is, what is it going to tell us? Indeed, what is it going to tell us? We should try scanning for UFO activity in the meantime. Oh, really? Do you think so? This thing that I'm doing, like by reflex, just to try and pass the time. You think this is the thing that I should be doing? I hate these people sometimes. I really do. Uh, okay, so we're going to go in here. I have a feeling that I've actually had this for a while the phoenix cannon confirmed yeah it's going to take a day um what are we going to do about these other places that really really could do with um more firestorms i don't know i don't know i, I full-on don't know do we have things in the gray market to sell this would be a, a question um like do uh, thin man corpses are getting a bit thick how many do we need we need like 50 right Okay, we're going to complete this transaction. This is all just to get, like, enough money so we can do these um, light plasma rifles, which are here, right? And we manufacture two of those. We there? We can do this, can't we? As I say, it's only going to leave me with two credits. But once we come back to the situation room and go, hey, uh, we want this pending request. Give me some... Oh, no, pending request. Give me some money. Dispatch those items. Okay. Boom! Money, money, money. No, not yet. We're going to go back. There we go. Look, a thousand credits. Yes. This is what we're after. So let's find out what's going on elsewhere. I don't think anything's going on elsewhere, actually. So, in here, I think what we could do is definitely afford to get some people some better armor. Um, <laughs> like the Carpace armor. Car Carpace? Carpace? Carpe Carp up race i don't know um is, is looking pretty good but the titan armor i think would be a lot better 25 engineers thankfully we've got enough and i want to try and make six if i can five if i can six if i can uh, i'm going to submit that there we go that's that's a lot of that's a lot of, lot of money a lot of stuff but I think all that armor is actually going to help us when we get to the barracks. Let's have a look at our soldiers here. Right, let's first off, let's get these guys in the assault classes. We definitely, no, don't want to customize them. We definitely want to change their loadout. Uh, so, Titan armor. With the added structural Ooh. support this suit provides, I expect the troops will take full advantage of the added firepower they can carry around. They'll also be much less susceptible to environmental hazards like fire while wearing it. Awesome. Oh, that sounds good, but I can't carry more stuff. He just said that I could carry more stuff, and I can't actually carry more stuff because there's no no space for it. That is terrible. Uh, and I've just noticed that my guy, well, he never really uses his pistol, does he? I was about to be like, oh, normal pistol, blah, 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 but we just don't use it. I, mean, I wish we could use that little hip space there for more grenades or something like that. that that'd be great. Don't you think so, Pedersen? Yeah, I knew you'd agree with me. Um, what else we got here? Yeah, pistol. A plasma shotgun probably wouldn't go uh, amiss. 
as we've got some money. Should we go and have a look? As they are kind of my front guys in, and Nakagawa, of course. That, the thing with Nakagawa is I want to see if we can do the Archangel um, stuff to change the research projects, right? Uh, the Archangel armor. Well, we're doing the ghost armor at the moment. Uh, I, I have no idea what stuff does what. Let's just, let's just give Nakagawa the stuff. I keep clicking on the wrong button at the moment. It's, it's terrible. Uh, by stuff, obviously, I do mean the Titan armor. I, I, it's nice being able to jump up and down and around and around, do all the other things that he does, but it, it's just not really going to work for me. Is there a way of selling this stuff that I don't need now? Um, I'm not. I'm really not sure. It'd be nice. It really would be nice. Sealed internal air supply reduce the system. Yeah, yeah. Uh, immunity to poison. Get in. That's what we want. Get rid of that. Like if if if. if and I'm going to bring up a sensitive subject here. If Marquez was wearing one of those, we could have possibly saved him because those poisons were definitely the thing that really just like pushed him over the edge. Okay, so as we are, I think that's kind of going to have to do. Uh, for putting our guys in Titan armor, mainly because all we've got... Oh no! Oh no! Well, at least... Oh my god, thank god. At least our support character has Commander, come back. We're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. Uh, it almost definitely has to be Brazil because of the panic elsewhere. Um, not Brazil, Mexico. Sorry, didn't really mean to get them mixed up. Uh, we get 200 money there for engineers. Why is it always engineers on the bit we need to do? I don't want more engineers. I want this sniper. But can't do anything about that because we've got to keep down the panic. Should we, should we go and have a look at how bad the, the panic is before we go? Let's have a look. Yeah, North. North America. That, that's two birds with one stone there as opposed to uh, like Brazil where we'd only get one. Um, okay, so Mexico. Let's do it. Let's do it. Right, we have a lot of a lot of newbies. It's got to be said. We have a lot of newbies here. We're going to do our best to uh, sort this out. But of course, one person who is not new is Doc Williams, man who has been with us the whole time. Um, definitely the one. Why doesn't he? Oh, because I sold their stuff. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to come back. I've got money. I've got money. So what we're going to do is going to go make um, make our guys some better rifles much better rifles we've got 600 odd rifle uh, money for rifles uh plasma sniper rifle we didn't want that we we literally just want the plasma rifle um laser rifle no have i not actually done it plasma rifle there we go i knew, I knew it would be there somewhere it had to be hidden around somewhere uh we want four of those i think i'm pretty sure it is let's do our assaults no, our sorts have the, the scatter lasers, though. We will see if we can do that as well. <laughs> it's the old school targets again. I love that. I love that. Uh, 100. Love that 100? Yeah. Well, that looks pretty powerful, though the smoke smoke effects are pretty weird. Um, I'd also like the scatter laser. Do we have a scatter plasma or a plasma scatterer? So, something like that. I don't really see it. Should we? Can we press and move down like this? We can. This is good. Medikit, sniper rifle, heavy plasma. It's not really what we're looking for. Alloy cannon. Uh, by developing fire makers. Uh, alloy cannon's a little bit, a little bit dodgy, and I'm pretty sure it's for the. Oh no, it can't be for that. It must be for this. Um, perhaps that is what we're looking for. But I do not see uh, the equivalent of the shotgun plasma. So we're just going to have to make do with what we've got. We're going to carry on here. We're going to go to finally go to Mexico. Sorry it's taken so long to actually get rolling. But here we go. And time to continue loading out our people. Like, so these two have got laser rifles. That's just going to have to do for the moment. Because as I said, I don't know where where the stuff is. But we can give him a plasma, plasma weaponry. And we can give him some plasma weaponry. Uh, including the Titan armor. Plasma rifle plasma rifle there we go uh we can't change the pistol but we will give him a nano fiber vest i suppose yeah yeah um that should be fine and what else we got this uh rookie edwards good evening my friend how are you you're also getting titan armor plasma rifle and i don't know what else you're getting you're gonna have a med kit just to back up doc williams just in case just in case everything goes wrong uh, I think this is a fairly good loadout. I don't think there's anything amiss there, so let, let's get going, let's get rolling.
Of course, as always, I am hoping for a built-up area as opposed to just being out in the arse end of nowhere. Um, I don't like trying to hide behind trees. I prefer walls. It's got, I've got to be honest, I do. Yes, putting brilliant. Down in Mexico for this mission. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. Oh yeah, major metropolitan area. We're in to save the civilians. Is it? Is this what we're here for? I don't know, we just kind of want to kill people, right? This is an abduction, not a terror mission, so, um, yeah, we'll do what we can do. Position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. Do we want to take over the building, or do we want to clear up round the outside before heading into the building? These things are difficult. These decisions have to be made. Um... I think we're going to go for the... Uh, I don't know. Going for the building kind of seems like the best way to activate as many aliens at once as possible and not really get anywhere from it. I don't, that's that's what I think is going to happen anyway. Um, you just watch this space. We're going to have a person dead within a, within a few moves. Um, uh, do we put Doc Williams there? Who else do we have? Uh, let's get some of these rookies up front. Now, Rookie Edwards... Oh, I've spun my map around too many times. Uh, Rookie Edwards is the man with the healing. Yeah, okay, so let's get the other guy, Mr. Hernandez. Uh, you can come up here. Is it Senor Hernandez? It's an Alfonso, so maybe... Um, yeah, maybe I should stop trying to, like... Uh, changing accents and stuff. Always just leads to a bit of a, a difficulty. So I was trying to decide where to put people there. It's not good when I don't really know what I'm trying to say at the same time. That's, uh, yeah, bad, man. It's bad. Uh, and I think, are we just going to dash over this way and then have a man over the side? I don't know. That kind of feels like uh, separating people out is a bad idea. We want, we want to kind of have them together. But I don't want to put him right next to here. So I think what I'm actually going to do is just stick him at the back of the car. Yeah, uh, not stabilised, we're going to Overwatch. Okay, let's see what comes our way. Anything could be coming our way here. Uh, I'm expecting trouble. I'm expecting big troubles. Um, Pedersen, do you want to go and have a look inside the door? You can't quite make it, can you? Uh, what about kicks? Can you make it? No, you're, you're too far away. Okay, so how about you come round this way? We're going to see if Nakagawa can get himself into a nice position as well. That that, that would be good. Having a, having a sniper who could see everything would definitely be an advantage but the question is where can we hide that gives him full cover that's not full cover uh full cover but still a good sight uh, all right let's do it uh, running my running my sniper forward isn't really the best idea is it um doc williams you are not going up forwards like that hernandez you're you're expendable up you go <laughs> yeah rookies are expendable right that's that's how it works <laughs> That's how it works for me anyway. Uh, Pedersen is going to go up and hide behind stuff. It, it's a bit of a dash. This is my problem. I don't really want to dash up there. Uh, let's... Oh, God. She'll be in position, at least, if nothing else. She can just stand out. I, I know I could have run and gunned it, but it just seemed like a bit of a waste, and I'll probably need it at a later point. Uh, Doc Williams is not going to be able to make it in one fluid run. Perhaps if he goes and hides behind this section of full cover here, we'll see what's going on next time. Uh, we seem to be spread out quite a lot over the map. A little bit worried about that because, well, because this is how I lose people, basically. Uh, and you are going to come down, play follow the leader with Hernandez. Uh, you are going to be Hernandez's med pack in case it's needed. All right, what's going to happen this time? What will happen this time? Uh, this time we've got some mutons coming in, but ha thankfully Kobayashi takes a reaction shot. Boom. And Nakagawa is right there. That's not good, actually. We don't want Nakagawa to be right there. Um... Yeah, that, that could be totally bad. Um, so that's an actual muton down. That's good. But what's going to be happening next time? Uh, like, here, what's going on with you? Okay, Nakagawa. If you take a headshot on this guy, right, you should get a double tap because he's totally out of cover, right? Oh, my. Whoa, 19 points of damage. Yeah, you get angry and run at him. See if I care. Whoa. Get wrecked. Hopefully. <laughs> that, that's it. Sniper rifle to the face. Nakagawa once again coming through and earning his stripes. Yeah. Okay, Doc Williams going to go have a look through the window. Oof, I feel, I feel all pumped after that. Yeah. Going to go fight some aliens. Come here and take over my 
what's this 24 hour shop <laughs> we, won't, we won't be having none of that here we like convenience stores and such well okay so um, maybe Pedersen can go in there single move so I can run away if need be no overwatch awesome I don't think we're gonna have any trouble with the inside here um, okay do we want to get Nakagawa up there eventually I, I, I kind of really do want to get Nakagawa up there eventually uh, that's a dash but that looks like a good dash ah oh, oh what no that was a terrible dash we, did you see the so there's that one and those guys up on the left there um, at least Pedersen's there to take advantage of it I suppose uh, it does mean she's in quite a bit of trouble though Okay, and here comes the second thing. If it's just Mutons and Berserkers, I think we should be able to do all right. We're, we're relatively good at... Oh, wow, look, he's going up top. Wait, we can go up top? Nakagawa, why aren't you going on the roof? What is going on here? Uh, this guy cannot go anywhere. That's terrible. Hernandez is going to come down here and shoot through the window, I think. Kind of has to be, doesn't it? Kind of has to be. At least if he's going to, like, cover Pedersen. Oh, my God, no. I've just done another buck. Oh, well, this this is it. Here we go, guys. We're going to fight hard. Um, hopefully, we're going to fight hard. We're going to shoot our way through the wall, by the looks of it. Yeah, no, that was terrible. Kind of taken away a load of my cover. Um, so, Hernandez. You best run, mate. Basically, you best run. We don't want to put everyone behind the same thing. Uh, perhaps here behind this door is going to be a bit bit more covered. Uh, there's not really much else we could do at that point. Um, and oh, I don't want to. I don't want to blow people up with the cars. Um, but let's see. We, we'll get around, right? We'll get around in case anything really bad happens. Uh, no, no chance to hit those. So we're just going to overwatch and let them come a little bit closer. Hopefully, that's how it'll play out. We'll see. But of course, we have some people that are in serious trouble. We have a lot of people that are in serious trouble. Did that hit the car or did that hit the side? Uh, either way, we're going to move him away. We've got, got to remember to move kicks out the way. Uh, he is going to, however, get hit by that berserker. Net. Oh, wow, there's there's so many of them doing so much stuff. Oh wow, they're going to blow their own cars up. Oh well, well, we will see, we will see. Is he throwing a grenade? It's cheeky, mate, that is cheeky. It's taking away most of my cover as well. Oh, that's, um... It's dodgy, it's terrible, and that's difficult. I, sp I suppose the, the adjectives I would like to use there. Are we done? Can we run away now? <laughs> um, Pedersen coming back here and then taking a shot or coming around here and take oh, I, I don't know I kind of want to just keep out of his way uh, at the same time he is the guy I want to run for and I could also take him down with that uh, so let's move Pedersen out of the way that, that's something that needs to and this guy also needs to move because oh my god he's going to get shot um, he's not going to get shot he's going to get um, blown up okay right so with those two taken care of what I'd like to do now is get Nakagawa and I really want to have a double tap on him, if possible. If, if just, please. Yes, th things like that. That's what I like. Uh, and if we can have a set, is he, is he going to come out? Is he going to run out? He's going to try. Is anyone going to get a reaction shot? This is the real, ooh, bit, bit of a... Thomas Williams, he could have a pop at him. More importantly, he could have a pop at the guys over there. Hmm. Did uh, Nakagawa not get a double tap? I really want to take care of these guys. Well, can we see more? What else have we got? Them, them. 71 there. It's not It's not great. It's got to be said, actually. We're going to try for this side. What, the, what is wrong with that? What is wrong with that? Okay, Mr. Edwards. There's not really much you can do here apart from go down and try and try and shoot these guys uh, I don't like the fact that we've got everyone exposed uh, uh, well, these two oh wow pow in the face that's what we're talking about uh, in here yeah 35% oh, chance 45% you know what you're just gonna overwatch mate you, you seem quite quite happy there um, Pedersen are we gonna shoot this guy in the back of the face yeah back of your face pow awesome and kicks, who can you see? 43%, not great. Perhaps we'll do a flush move? I oh, know, we just gotta hit him in the face. Just gotta hit him in the face. 
Yeah, just like that. A single point of damage is all it takes sometimes. It's all it takes sometimes. So that card's going to blow up. I was expecting that. Uh, I'm also expecting the other card to blow up. No? Yeah. That's what did anyone Did anyone die from that? I didn't see any hit, any damage things come up. No, nothing so far. Okay, well, we'll just have to accept it as it is. The aliens are having activity, but I can't see what it is they're doing. Uh, these He's going to throw a grenade, I'm sure, at some point. Ooh. Oh, did that not blow those guys up? You'd expect it to blow those two up at some point. Okay, so let's start with the rooks. Uh, where are they? Hey there, rookies. You guys really need to start worrying about this lot. Uh, so how can you get some position up? I don't know, you can't even come out over here, can you? Uh, perhaps into here's the place? Let's try it. How many more are we going to end up seeing? Still a 35% chance to hit. He's terrible, isn't he? He is absolutely terrible. Uh, and then we've got the other rookie. Where is he? Where's he gone? Uh, not Doc Williams. There we go. Edwards. Mr. Edwards. Uh, what can you see? A 55% chance to hit. That's pretty poor. Do we go closer? The problem is, if we go closer, we're going to like get this guy coming at us. But I, th I think we can deal with that. I think we can deal with that. Okay. Straight for him. What is that noise? Yeah. Rookie showing us how it's done. Um, okay, what's next? Right, our assault staff need to go in somehow. Um, I, I'm really not sure how. I, I have lost track of people. I reckon there's people up here, or at least there's one alien up here. Uh, there was definitely a lot more aliens. Definitely a lot more aliens. But I just, I, I, I'm not sure. I do not know. So, I don't know. Is a run and gun worth it at this point? I, I don't think it is. Let's go into the half cover here. All right, nothing to watch. That's cool. Um, not quite reloading time yet, but definitely getting close. Uh, and Kix can come over here. Uh, and maybe he will reload? No, he's just going to overwatch as well. Should have reloaded. We all know I should have reloaded. Nakagawa is going to reload. Okay, and Doc Williams could come in and give some healing uh, to Brit. She doesn't need much, thankfully, though. Uh, so I think Doc Williams is actually going to come over this way and we're going to start making our way towards that Muton, like the Berserker, whatever he is. Uh, in fact, a 70% uh, hit chance. Going to take that shot. Yeah, look at that. Go on then, run at me. Come at me, brah. No? Yes. Yes, he is coming at me. And now everyone's going to just shoot at him. And hopefully we're all going to... Oh, they're all going to die. Not so hot on Pedersen taking out other people's cover whilst doing that sort of thing that's that's not great uh we've got a berserker at the back of the building here that's fine five points down straight away we've only got to do that three more times uh, <laughs> we'll, we'll see what happens but where is he okay so he's, he's full-on coming in for me oh he's right at Ped pedersen's place he's right at pedersen's place and he is also running in the other berserker that looked like close enough for him to be able to have a hit though uh so pedersen hey you seem to have a berserker right in your face do you think you want to shoot at him yeah, <laughs> that's what we're talking about. Does he, does he get another go? Does he get another go? Um, oh, where's he going? Oh, bye. Did, did, you, did you watch him just run away there? I watched him just run away. Right, you... My God, you need to... Perhaps running away a bit would be a good first step and then like back here somewhere and then shoot at him. I'm not sure if that's going to do anything, but it, oh, I just feel a lot better. His... To hit is rubbish, isn't it? Absolutely de terrible. Okay, Hernandez is going to get a shot off at this guy. Hopefully this will kill... My God, my rookies are rubbish. You all deserve to die. Whoa. Okay, perhaps it's run and gun time. I, th I think it's run and gun time. Going in for the kill. Yeah, you are. You, you full on are, mate. You're going to come in down here. It's not often that he says that and that's actually right, but we've we've got to just take him out. Wow, right, and who's left? Nakagawa. <laughs> Whoops. Maybe not the best way to have organised my go. Doc Williams here, is it? Yeah, no, Doc Williams has to reload. Can't I just swap my rifle with this guy here? All right, well, he's going to have to reload. Uh, Nakagawa literally full-on cannot shoot at anybody, which to me screams he needs to get up here somewhere. Uh, so let's start thinking about that, shall we? Let's start by a dash... Dustwoods. 
It's a good strong start. It will then also put me in room to be sniping that guy afterwards. We're just going to have to wait and see what happens. Like, uh, I'm not. I don't like what's going on here. That car is no, no. What is he doing? I never understand what these guys are doing. They they they, they make a move one way and then they turn around and go elsewhere. It's just. Oh, oh, he's busted through the wall at me. Oh my, he's busted through the wall at me. Right, Pedersen needs to reload. Uh, Kicks also <laughs> needs to reload. Maybe it's time to fall back a bit, mate. Just back there somewhere. Uh, and this, this guy. Uh, no, so you're going to reload. There we go. Okay. Uh, Nakagawa can take a shot at him. Is that worth it? Yeah, of course it's worth it. Through the bushes, into his face. Bang. That was actually into his face as well. Do we have any more that we're watching out for? No. So my guess is they're all the way up here. How do we get up here? It's a dash. That's no good. We don't want a dash. Um, do we have anyone that can do it without a dash? You. Can you get up here without a dash? You can. It's mainly so I can just turn around and run away if there are people up here. Let's, let's have a look. Climbing up the drain pipe. Yeah, there he is. I knew he'd be about somewhere. Is it just two hits? 58% chance to hit. You're going to do it. Go on. It's your only chance. Booyah! Oh, that was that was tense. We still have more left. We still have other people we're supposed to be looking for. Okay, so Doc Williams. Uh, you know what? You can just kind of run down here. We'll get a look around the corner, see if there's anything else going on. Um, there we go. Awesome. Uh, right, reload. Blatantly. Anyone who is less than full... Less than full is gonna is gonna get real. I should have given him a move first, shouldn't I? Okay, Pedersen is on her way now. I've got a feeling they're all over here, um, so we are gonna just just slowly make our way over. Uh, there's no point like risking too much trouble because um, no one likes trouble, right? Well, I don't like trouble. I'm not here for trouble. I'm just here to kill aliens and stuff. <laughs> okay, so through the window. No, nope, nothing out here either. Where are they all? Nakagawa. Um, perhaps you'd do well to go up top. Where did you hear it from? I didn't I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Wow, where is he going? Through a window, up a drain pipe, through the charred remains of a wall. I and mean, what more do you want? Okay, Nakagawa, can't do much there. Uh, Doc Williams. Ah, you're a bit you're a bit out of the way over here actually. No, we can't even get around there without a dash. Let's get on the other side of the car probably a bad idea actually because they're going to be coming from over there right um but we're going to overwatch just in case you know it's always nice to have a just in case plan uh, and this guy is just literally gonna um come and hide behind this table just try and get him more into the fray he's a little bit a little bit left behind back there bless him uh hernandez you need to come over here and you also need to reload boom okay uh, we, it'd be nice to get Nakagawa here, actually. Yeah, all the way over there, you say. What is making that noise? What is making that noise? Do you think it's an alien? Nah, couldn't be, surely. Um, do we want to run and gun? Kind of want. Let's do it. Let's do it. Haul ass. We know where we're going, so let's go. We're gonna haul ass, as Brit says quite a lot. Oh, lightning reflex. Where did he come from? Booyah! And this is why I have my assault people. Um, well, we're here, so fire. 99% chance to hit, but death? Not quite death. I am going to have a shot. He's, he's going to have a shot back. But Kicks gets to go here. Oh, was that the right place? Yep, yes it was. And we're going to just shoot at him as well. And hopefully this is it. Pow! Now that is what I call a good mission. I've not had a mission like that in a long time. Woo! Let's get back to base. Let's get back to base. There is panic in Brazil! Okay, well, there's not much we can do about that, I don't think. Uh, I, hopefully, we can send up a satellite. This is, this is my, my plan for things like this. Hopefully we can send up a satellite. Uh, but panic in Brazil shouldn't be too much of an issue. It's only if they pull out at the council report that is, is a real... A single casualty among the entire squad. Indeed, and look at these promotions. Okay, Kicks Kobayashi gets his resilience, immunity to crits, or killer instinct. Activating rust and run and gun now sort of gets 50% uh, critical damage for the rest of the turn. I'm going to go with the resistance to crits because I don't want him to die. Uh, 
Okay, Mr. Edwards has been promoted to sniper. That's 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 all right. We can, we can deal with snipers. Gonna get you a plasma sniper rifle, mate. That that would be good. Uh, and we've got a new support guy, which is kind of what we needed. I, I, I did kind of push him in to be that. Okay, we got some stuff. Um, we've got some panic, unfortunately, but we have also decreased panic elsewhere. Pex only in Mexico. Did we not do Remember, anywhere else? Oh, that was rubbish. Will be watching. Yeah, but you're not really doing much, are you? I mean, it's all good watching, but uh, Brazil. Launch the satellite. Okay, awesome. We're going to get an extra 80 per month. It's going to take five days to get there. Alright, then panic across Africa is quite strong. We're, we're going to have to deal with that at some point as well. In fact, next abduction, I'm sure we will be dealing with that. But until that time, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time where hopefully we're going to have another ripping adventure like that. Um, but yeah. Bye!